Happy January, everyone, and welcome to 2017. I am sure by now you have read lots of New Year, New Me statuses, and I thought that maybe, just maybe, in this video, I could give you something or some motivation that might actually just give you a New Year, New You. Okay, so let's say that I am some kind of sorceress or someone with magical powers and I give you a notebook and I say, here's a notebook, it's got blank pages, write me two stories. Now, I have some rules, okay? In the two stories, both people have to go through the exact same story. They have to have the exact same conflicts, the exact same um, circumstances. Everything that goes wrong with one must go wrong with the other. The difference is, story number one, you must be the victim. Everything that happens to you is poor me, woe is me, everything happens to me, life is not fair. The other, you're going to be the warrior, the hero, the person who says, I know that what's going on right now sucks, but I am going to rise above it. So I tell you, I say, write these two stories. And you go and you take the notebook I've given you and you write these two stories. And you come back to me and you're like, why the heck did I just write these two stories? And I say to you, now, I am going to make your life just like one of these stories. But I'm going to let you pick which. So, it's up to you. Do you want to play the victim or the warrior, the hero? It's up to you. You can have either one. Now, if you're smart, you're probably going to pick the warrior. But I see every day, every day, people picking to be the victim. Why? It doesn't make sense. Just like in this story that I have created, God has given us the, the choice, the, the willpower to pick to either be the victim or the warrior. So why are you choosing to be the victim? When something happens in your life, you have the choice to either let it affect you forever and just say, that's it, it's over. Or you can move on, you can learn how to overcome things. I'm not saying it's gonna be easy. I'm not saying that's even easy to figure out how you're gonna overcome things. I'm just saying that it's possible. If every superhero ever just stopped because something went wrong, like, the bad guy would always win. Like, things always go wrong. That's just what happens in life and even in movies. But if you want to be a warrior, if you want to be a hero, an overcomer, you have to figure out ways to move on, to keep going, to better yourself. And just because maybe you act a certain way doesn't mean that's how it always has to be. You may say, oh, well, I just always procrastinate. That's just who I am. No, that doesn't have to be just who you are. You have the willpower. You have the choice to be any kind of hero you want. If you want to be punctual, be punctual. If you want something, it's yours. So I'm challenging you this year to not play the victim. To instead decide that this year you're going to take the step to become the warrior, the hero of your own story. And that no matter what happens to you, you're going to figure out a way to overcome that. Because you can. You are the author of your story. So don't let setbacks keep you back. Keep moving forward. Don't play the victim. You... No one likes a victim. No one does. Someone who's just like, yeah, so this happened to me and my life sucks and it's always going to suck because there's nothing I can do. Really? There's nothing you can do? You can't stop complaining? You can't stop whining? You, can, you can't figure out a way to make life work? I don't believe that load of crap. <laughs> I don't believe that. I believe that you have the power. You have the strength. 
to make your life whatever you want it to be. So be the hero. I believe fully in you. I believe that you can and were meant to be the hero. You just have to take that step. So make 2017 the year that you stop playing the victim. The year that when things happen to you, you decide that you're the hero and that you're going to overcome, that you are a warrior and there isn't anything in this world that can stop you. Make this year your year. Thanks so much for watching, you guys. I cannot wait to spend this entire year with you, hopefully inspiring or motivating in some kind of way. If there's something you'd like to hear me talk about, just leave it in the comments below, and I will make sure to take a look at it and see if I can't give you some, some of my thoughts. Now, please enjoy some of last year's bloopers. So my communication is key, like communication is key 